All right, so we bought an underground bunker. That's the above ground part. You know, you might ask why? Why did we buy an underground bunker? There's the glass door down there. So it's been a dream of mine for a while to own an underground bunker. Hey, Dad. Uh, we were living in Peachtree City, but we had an opportunity to buy this facility, so goodbye suburban life, hello underground living. This facility here is an old um, AT&T facility. It's a uh, nuclear grade bunker. It was built in the 60s by the government and AT&T. We've got blast doors, we've got escape hatches. There's still some work that needs to be done to get it uh, livable. We're actually gonna live in it. My family just moved into the bunker on Friday. We took a video of the moving truck pulling in and posted it on TikTok. On Sunday, I get a text message from my sister-in-law saying, you have over 2 million views on your video. We, we didn't even tell her that we posted anything on TikTok. We didn't tell anybody. Okay, yeah, you know what? I'm locked in here. Nobody can get in. I'm totally safe. I'm as safe as probably anyone is in the world right now. So still no water. And we have a device that will measure our air quality. Joan sends me this text saying, hey, you know, what's going on there? Our industrial fumes thing is just sort of steady and low and no problem. And then it just sort of spikes up in a major way. This bunker is unrenovated, but we're gonna renovate it. That's the exciting part of the story. It's not a home, so it needs to be turned into a home, and, and that's what we're gonna do. 